Just a second. Okay. And where are my captions? Caption me. Caption me. Hello. There we are. Okay. Time for some Kingdoms of Amalur. Um, 
I'll be honest with you, it's my least favorite game of all the games I'm playing. <coughs> but it's kind of growing on me. Um, what are we on? We're on part 10. So we've been playing a while. Roughly two hours each. Play. That's what I... I hit the wrong thing. <clears throat> there we go. Alright. Here we go. It, Like I said, it's growing on me. Uh, meet with Ellen Karth in Rathir. And I just got to Rathir. Lyria, like your way. We have a problem. Elund Karth refuses to send any troops to assist Melsen Shear. The old fool never would listen to reason. A weapon is only as strong as the one that wields it, and a general is only as powerful as the army she leads. We need to convince Karth to lend us his aid. You can find him in the upper city, Excuse looking me. over the strait at Melsen Shear. A fool might as well be condemning the city. Okay. They're in the city, but they can't join us unless Elund Karth grants his blessing for them to go with us. Agarth has gone to reason with him. He was a fine fighter, as I recall, but I do not know if his diplomacy is as practiced. All right. The man is not a warrior by nature. He cannot abide another risk for this city. But he's an idiot if he thinks we will get another opportunity such as this. <clears throat> All right. Well, let's. I have to go to the upper Lyria, city. Like your way. Come, have a look. Um. Okay. So I'm thinking. Goods these... for sale. This way. Okay. No, no, it is not. What do we got, though? In search of a game of X's. You want Kest in the lower tunnels. I'll sell you weapons, but if it's armor you need, you'll have to speak to that husband of mine. All righty. Um. I've got eighty one nine. Um, Prismere Chakram. Oh, these are three hundred and forty thousand. I don't think I can afford them. Um, let's see. Prodigies Chakrams. Let's compare them. They're garbage. Parts, pieces, pieces, parts. Sell all junk. Okay. What can I sell? Mmm. Mmm. Does 97, but it's extremely slow. Um, <clears throat> you know, I'm going to sell it. Totem of the Wild only does 48. <clears throat> Damn it. Ooh, why? <clears throat> I 
kind of cool, but um, Solstice does 101. Physical Fire, yeah, I actually need to switch over to it, but I don't think... Oh, I might be able to. Desire... There's a scepter. Yeah, I'm going to sell it. <clears throat> I'm going to sell that. Eighty. Yep, I'll sell those. Crackling staff. Sixty-four. It does. Yep, I'm going to sell that. Curus of the Martyr. I'm wearing Crude Azerite. I can't wear it yet because it requires a 19 might. So I have at least a 16. Now, in order to wear that... Magus's Helm. And I also need 19 might for that. Um, this I can wear, but it's pretty... Pretty much equal. Gives me mana regen. <clears throat> instead of sorcery abilities. Actually, I might... Mm, I think I would actually be better off wearing the Restoring Helm. Um, gloves. Uh, an armor socket and two utility sockets, which is nice, but I'm already wearing something better. E it would give me resistances and stuff. You know what? I'm just going to sell them. Buckler of Preservation is 61 instead of 59, but I have to have a 21 finesse. So... Knight's Gloves. Mm. Sell. Azerite Chausses. 77. Once I get a Might of 19. Uh, leggings of Fire Hindrance. Finesse of 18. They are better. Um, sell them. Azerite Kai Shield. <clears throat> I need a Might of 18. Um, I think I am actually going to sell that because I like the magical properties. Azerite Greaves. I need a Might of 19. But other than giving me the sockets, they don't buy me anything. So I'm going to sell. And sell. And I think that's good enough for now. I just don't foresee myself getting into the weapon building in this. I really like it in things like Skyrim. Um, but I just have no interest in it in this. Just the way it is. Um, I just don't see any point in keeping those things. Now, these I can turn into these gems. Um, bleeding resistance. I am going to sell those. Ice shield, protection, phasing. What is phasing? 
uh, increase armor's effectiveness. Okay, okay, okay. Refuge. Okay. Um, rigid. All right, so those I can actually put in armor. So I'm going to hold on to them for now. Um, although, eh, I think I might sell a couple of those. Yeah, we'll call that good. Um, I still can't afford anything. I mean, I can get stuff like this, but these are great shield, great swords. I do not like great swords. Um, so I just don't see the point. So, all right. Come see me again. Go talk to the hubby. Sif, Sif Seder at your service. Don't mind the racket. Just my wife at Harpy across the way. Okay. 700. I'm just curious. Um, 326. Wow. Wow. Okay. Sylvanite. Curious. I have to have a might of 28. So, yeah. I'm thinking I can't... I, I can afford to buy it. I'm just so far from being able to use it, it's not worth it. So... Um... Sylvanite Chausses, 28. Yeah. Hexweave Cowl, Sorcery of 28. And it's not as good armor. Yeah. Um... I'm so long. Ten years. This siege has gone on too long. Got anything in need of mending? I can do it. Okay. Heck yeah. Um. Repair all. Okay. Awesome. Would you the say? army keeps Lord in the burn. Wouldn't want to be caught cutting purses there. Very easy to spell. Nope. Don't want to. I don't want to steal in this. Um, I'm just going to go back out. Okay, so. Do not miss Leogriff's many marvels. There we go. The Upper City. Any sense into you, 
then someone else will have to. Damn fool. What do you want? I'm beset by petitioners these days. Mm -hmm. Another advocate for this absurd plan to retake Melson Shear, I take it. It's good to see that karma heads have prevailed. It pains me to say it, but Melsen Shear was lost long ago. Mm -hmm. If Vane attempts to restore it will only lead to more death. I'm just gonna... I am the Elund, and I speak with the voice of the Orbagat. Within this city, my word is law. Okay. They have delved earthward where we <coughs> have lifted high. They think no one watches them because they are thus sheltered. The deeper they dig, the higher we will rise. Okay. They rule Rathir, and they do so from behind a veil. I am their face and their voice. Okay. While human tribes wandered kingless, and Odessa was not a flicker of a thought, Rathia stood. It has stood a thousand years. If our fate holds, if this war does not topple us, it shall stand a thousand more. Cool. The sieged outpost has sent hundreds of refugees. But as long as Mel Senshir still stands, they refuse to accept their fate. It sounds cruel to say, but it would be best if it fell quickly. Then we could all get on with our lives. The sieged outpost has said. It sounds cruel to say, but it would be best if it fell quickly. Then we could all get on with our lives. Hmm. The city of walls is lost to us, and we can afford no more troops <coughs> for them. Better to muster our forces to counterattack after its fall. Do not speak to me of the war. I am the voice of Rathia, not a general or a fate weaver, nor Lyria herself, who alone controls the outcome. Okay. Look to Rathia's sister across the strait. Her battered walls, her burned gardens, her back broken from a decade of war. We take in refugees. We send food we can spare. We try to ease her pain, but for ten years I've stood here and watched her die slowly. And you think a failed general and an old spear will save her now? Why should we spare anything for Talera's hopeless fantasy? Our city is already taxed to breaking with the wounded from Melz and Shear. We cannot afford to help you, but they might. Those that have been healed have been begging to return, to fight for the walls that have stood for all this time. You wish to throw your life away? They do as well. Captain Dodwin will help your ship of fools, but Rathia's hopes have been raised and dashed too often. When you fail, have the decency to choose death over dishonor. Go to the eastern docks in the lower city and find Captain Dodwin. He will oversee your journey to Melson Shear. Okay. Go. Save our sister across the sea city or watch. die with her. Be on your way. Okay. Well, that was not terribly difficult. We didn't get troops, but we got troops. Stand aside. <laughs> so we didn't get troops of the city. We got troops that want to return that were there to begin with. Okay. Students of magic, masters of spells. What is this? Historical marker. OK. 
Okay. Greetings, Wars. Stand up straight and look you in the eye. Your comrade dies, the job is yours. Another body for the ground. The ships are loading now for Melsen Shear. Are you ready to board? Right away. Yep. Agarth, you know better than any of us how this will end. Why must we fight a war that you know we will not win? You would still ask that to Lara. After all you've seen. Until I get an answer, Fate Weaver. Until then. Why do we fight? Because there is hope. Because only through battle can we break the chains that fate has forged. Don't you see? We have been given a chance, and though some of us will die, we will die knowing that our lives were finally our own. That we are no longer slaves to the whims of fate. Okay. Would you throw it away? Just for fear of another defeat? Not I. I will fight. And if I die, I die knowing that I have made a choice. And this choice, for good or for ill, was my own. Alrighty, fine speech. <clears throat> Been up for days. Tuatha are relentless. We get no, not exactly the heroes of legend, but you're a welcome sight nonetheless. Likely, you've come to see the fortress before it falls. I've seen her stand for the last ten years, but the end, I think, has finally come. Our scouts well, if I can help that it. the Tuatha are massing, and in their wake we've seen it. The Niskaru Lord, Baylor, has come for Melsenshir at last. Baylor could tear through our walls like parchment. Our only hope is to ambush before they can bring him forward and take the Tuatha by surprise. While our forces delay Baylor, you and Talera will be sent to hunt the witch knight, Malwin. It's likely that he will hold the Baylor sway during the battle. We can't best their army in the open field. My hope is with Malwin dead, the Baylor will turn on the Tuatha. It is little more than a wish, but that's all we have. Okay. The real mission goes to General Talera and yourself. My place is with my brothers and sisters, on the ground and against the enemy. When you're ready, okay. come meet me by the gates. We've hidden from these nightmares long enough. Now we must face them, and perhaps we'll live to see the morning. Okay. Blood for the wall. Another body for the ground. The general has returned. Okay. Ready for battle. The Tuatha are relentless. We get no peace here. The general has returned. Great general is back, just like she promised. Another ten years. Okay, I can you go to long. merchants. I don't care like. if the bartenders back the ramparts. Someone has to have a drink for sale. Can't seem to sleep. Watch yourself when you're on the wall. Taking a sweet time. So. 
sworn to war. There he is. Okay. Pause. Hold on a minute. All right. Very nice, very nice. Um, I just had to check on something here. But I'm not going to concern myself with it right now. But it is something I will be doing later. <clears throat> All right. Talk to what the is commander. It? Time is running out. You said... Steal yourselves. The battle is not to be taken lightly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then let us go. We've had sightings of the Tuatha Vanguard. When they enter the courtyard, we will open the gates and counterattack. You and Talera will use the distraction to execute your plan. One way or another, this will be over soon. Okay, reach the outer wall. <laughs> troops hold, then Malwin will be delayed at the outer wall with the Baylor. But we should make sure he doesn't get past us. Now, we must get moving. There is no room for error. Okay. Okay. 
It looks like the defenses have been activated. Be careful. Uh. Ouch. Wait a minute. I got turned around and I went the wrong direction. Stay down, and you need to move before O'Waglin's troops start falling back. Okay. Finally, some reinforcements. We tried to fight off the two up, but they took <clears> most <throat> of our company prisoner. And threatened to execute the rest unless we lay down our arms. You could get in amongst them, silently, if possible, and save what's left of the survivors. Okay.
Is it worth it? I'll try. I'm going to need every one of those potions I can get, I think. Control of the creature. Theoden, oh! guide my hand. For the fear. Shot in the back. Oh. Ends here! Ah! Ah! 
chance to defeat the Baylor. You! You're still alive! Yep. You've got to destroy Baylor before it tears this place apart. Yep. I'm headed there. I know, Joe. Everything seemed still in that moment when she struck the Baylor. At least she died how she wanted to. But her sacrifice won't mean anything unless you do something to stop that beast. Yes, sir. Lots to, lots of guys to fight, that's for sure. Damn it. 
And shears free. It's over. After all these years, the siege is broken, and we're alive. Thank the gods for sending you to us. This is a glorious day, but I have heard a bitter rumor in the wake of all of this. Is it true? Has Talera fallen? Then the rumors of her dishonor will finally be silenced. She gave everything to us in the end, and the world will know that. When we rebuild these walls, we'll name them after General Talera. Her memory will stand as long as the ramparts shine. But she never would have been here had you not delivered her to us. It can never be enough, but we hope you'll accept this as our thanks. Don't I get a parade? <laughs> we freed the city, but the Tuatha still hold most of Cluricon. Over the years, they've infected every part of these swamps. Clearing them out isn't going to be easy, but we might have help. There are rumors of a small band of fighters harassing the Tuatha. Perhaps Ooh, the hero me. of Mel Senshir can convince them to work with us. Good luck. We changed the course of the war and defeated the greater Niskaru Baylor. Songs of bravery and heroism will be sung for generations. Plus four experience, plus six damage. Cool. Our soldiers are doing their best out there, but it's still a nightmare. Watch out for those red-eyed bastards. Sure. Okay. Um, I can level up, but I want to see... I think, if I remember right, that was a... Uh... 19 might 19 yeah all right so 
Um, what do I want to do here? Dispelling and lock picking seem to be the two things you use the most. So I'll do that. I need to put two points into might. Yeah, I'll do one there and one there. Finesse. All right, so now that should mean um, well, let's see. What have I got that's... This is what I'm... 87. Uh, I don't want a great sword. Mm, no, no, no. I'm going to stick with what I've got there, but my chakrams are 125, 80, 80, and 101. Fire. Yeah, I guess I'll stick with them. So the rest of these things I'm going to get rid of. Armor, though. doesn't give me all of those things, but it is a couple points higher. I think I'm going to stick with what I've got there, and I'm going to sell everything I'm not wearing. another one of those that's part of a set I'm going to keep Solstice because it is pretty good damage and um, in case, because I've had mine break before, I can quickly switch over to Solstice. Alright, now I want to find a merchant. The hero of Mel Senshir. Yes, I've got buy my stuff. I've got plenty of supplies if you've got plenty of coin. Sell all junk. Okay. Um, don't care about hammer daggers. Let's see. 115 as opposed to 125. Nope. Um, Paladin Chakrams. 107. $200. 
202. Can't wear them for quite a long time, though. Finesse 36. Um, ooh. Double. Or very close to double the armor. Let's look at the other. That would really help. But this one... Oh, I can't use it. The ebony buckler, though. Oh, I can't use it either. Prismir Greaves. 40 might. Come back again. Talk to this guy. Greetings. Interested in a trinket or a gem? Realty's Ma has what you need. Okay. Arctic Staff of Gluttony. 167 versus 87. That would be a big kick in the ass. Um, 95 versus 87, still doing fire damage, but my chakrams do fire damage. Um, that wouldn't have been bad either. Red scale armor. 39 finesse. Whew. 80. That would be a nice, nice one. Ring of light. Another time then. Whoops. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and sell that. Interested in a trinket or a gem? Realty's Ma has what you need. Another time then. Okay. it and I don't have a wait a minute what was this travel to helm guard key oh okay. uh, quests silence falls Find allies in Cluricon. Okay. 
so do so way. Greetings. Cursewood. Alrighty. You stop. State your business. Keep your hands off me, fool. I'm no Tuatha. I must speak with the Seeds Breaker. It is a pleasure to meet the Seeds Breaker. Especially here, in a land where pleasure has been all too rare. I okay. am Sidon the Outcast, Prince in Exile of the House of Sorrows. I'm here to welcome you to our home. I see the hesitation in your eyes. Although I am Fay of the Winter Court, you and I have a common enemy. Okay. I am Sidon the Outcast. Once I was Prince of the House of Sorrows, but my true duties are to the true Court of Winter. The Winter Fay have been disgraced and despoiled by Gadflo and the Tuatha. With your help, I can end their reign. Okay. Clearly, I'm not Tuatha. I carry a loathing for them that mortals could never understand. I simply approached your lines peacefully and expressed my desire to speak with the Siege Breaker. It seems that even the simplest mortal soldier can recognize an ally against our mutual enemy. Okay. You shouldn't. The Winter Fay knows that trust is a weakness. But sometimes, an alliance is necessary. You accomplished a great feat here. But the Tuatha de Own are far from defeated. I can offer my aid in your campaign. You'll find my companions and me at Foe's Hearth to the east. We can speak more there. Okay. I'd rather not talk here. Cluricon is filled with Tuatha spies. Travel to the old ruins at Foe's Hearth. We'll meet you inside and we can talk there. Okay. Now be careful. These swamps can be treacherous. Pick up skulls. So far, nothing really bad.
No, we're going the wrong direction. I figured I had to be finding one of these pretty soon. Winter is strong in this place. When first the Fae walked into its depths, it bore great fossils, bones of beasts greater and more terrifying than we Fae. But for all their strength, the earth at their feet lasted longer. It sapped their strength, their life, their flesh. I have waited some time for you to come, Siege Breaker, and it seems that my patience has, at least, been worthwhile. Okay. The House of Sorrows has need of your might. Aid us, and you will earn a strong ally in the war against the Tuatha Deon. Like your Althar allies, we Winterfey suffer under the Tuatha's onslaught. And like the Althar, we Winterfey need a champion. Okay. But it is a difficult position we are in, mortal. The Fae are not like your kind. We have different priorities, different threats. We need someone who understands that. It is not a simple task I ask of you. I have only approached you because you show the potential of use. You must still prove your worth. Sure. Go to the Midden and find the place called the Proving Halls. This hearthstone will grant you access. Once you are within the halls, my questions will be answered. Hmm. Okay. The Prismere Shantries stole the will. Sided. The Prismere Shantries stole the will. It is oh, no. agreeable to see you, Siegebreaker. Cluricon can be inhospitable at times. As the Tuatha have learned, <laughs> we've made sure of it. <sighs> Frost, the last few remnants of free winter fay. Okay. We have refused to bend knee to Gadflo or his god. Our numbers are few, but we have fought our kin as best we can. For once noble houses of sorrow, pride, and vengeance have all fallen under Gadflo's sway. Until they're freed, the Tuatha's ranks will continue to swell with the faithful. Blind him. Cut out his tongue. Draw the venom from our land. Only then will we be able to begin to strike at Alabastra. The Tuatha have built Prismere Chantries across Cluricon. From here, Gadflo rallies the faithful, preaches the word of Tirnok, and corrupts our land. Destroy these Chantries and disrupt Gadflo's ability to infect its land. Without Gadflo to guide them, the Tuatha in Cluricon will be disorganized and scattered. When okay. This is done, he'll take you to Ventrinio. He can help you breach Alabastra. There are three of them to the south and east. Kill their guards, then smash their crystals and be done with them. Gadflo will try to stop you, but it's just a harmless projection. He can't hurt you. At least, not directly. Okay. Now, break the tyrant's grip.
Okay, so there's one. So I'm going to go this way first. This one over here. Oh, hello. Looking like And it way. Oh, 
Know you? You are the one who slew the Baylor at Melson Shear. Yes, that was me. I was at that battle as well. It was my unit that drove the Tuatha off the southern wall. Please, you must help me. Those Jotun will not let me survive much longer. The key to this cage is held by a Jotun rune lord just down the road. That fat bastard comes by here every morning and taunts me with it. Please. Retrieve it and get me the hell out of here. Okay. Thank you. The Jotun Rune Lord is just down the road. Please hurry, for I have unfinished business in the keep on the hill. Until the next time. Ooh. Try. Okay. Oh, all right. Money. All right. Actually, while I'm right, right here, I might as well. Faithful, a child of dust is here for death. <laughs> Undying mortal from the well has returned. Your mere existence yep. is an abomination against all things. How can you not see this? Mortals pervert the world, twisting it to their own ends. Your unnatural new life is only the latest in a long line of your kind's debaucheries. But Tiernok the Merciful chose me to be the cure. My army is the wildfire that will clear the land of you and your kind. Sure, man. Sure.
Okay, back down here. This way. Back up to the cage. Let her free. Thank Lyria. Please tell me that barrel of Craddock's slime died painfully. I have another favor to ask of you, hero. The Witch Knight Glaren is holed up in Genig, the keep on the hill. Meet me inside so that we can hunt him. We cannot let one of the Tuatha's generals escape. We need to go to Genig, the keep on the hill. Meet me in. Good luck. Yeah, I'll go ahead and help her kill this dude. Why not? Ready to go. Um, I'm gonna... What's seven? You are here. Claren has filled this place with Jotun mercenaries. He must not have had that much faith in the Tuatha cause. We cannot let him escape. He must die. Okay, let's go. No doubt he has surrounded himself Doesn't with Jotun did. guards. This will not be easy. I am not sure. We must find the Witch Knight, Claren, and defeat him. Good luck.
Okay, well. Time to waste. We must find Claren and kill until the next time. Okay, so where are we going? We're going this way. Broken body does nothing to lessen my anger. All of the Tuatha will suffer for their barbarity. Thank you, hero. I will return to the main Alpha army with the news of the Witch Knight's death. Okay. Until next time. Demon horns. Hundred and twenty fast speed. Yeah. Um. 
and the scepter is only seven, 70 points, but... Alright. out of curiosity. Oh, my God. 
start to compare. Eh. Okay. Five chakrams of wildfire, but I'm using those other things right at the moment. So that is a permanent drain on your mana if you have those things on, but they are nice. I'm going to try this next. stay on this one for a minute and see where it goes. Oh, my God. 
kind of worth it. Um... I don't know so much about the shield specifically, but Inventory items. Hmm, 77. Okay, if I need to. If I need to. Okay. I like those. They do a lot of damage. Let me go back to these, though. Ah. 
Okay. <clears throat> I'm going to take a quick break. I'll be back. we ready to get back to it? I think we are. Okay. <coughs> All right, I'm going to take a left. And
no sense of even picking it up. Alright. Wait a minute. Yeah. Disciple shoes. I'll take that because it's named. But only because it's named. So that didn't get me where I needed to go. Raw nil. So I'm going to go back to there, I guess. I mean, I guess I could go through here and see if it comes out in another spot. Ooh. It was a time of change. The cycles of the seasons turned as ever, but inside the bones of the earth, there lurked a cold. It was not the cold of winter. Beside the houses of sorrows, pride and vengeance, a new turmoil fomented. A magic hitherto unseen. Level up. Okay, I'm going to put it in... Mercantile. Okay. Um.
that is better armor. Oh, I can't use it yet anyway. Um, 39. Plus 10 mana regen. Ice resistance. Eh. Oh, I've got to get my might up higher for that. 156, 154. Hmm. Heartstone. Okay. They're the same as what I'm wearing, but not quite as good. Ooh. I will be equipping those. Oh, okay. Wait a minute. Wrong way. Kind of cool with the faces and stuff, but...
Okay, that'll come up later, so I'll be back here at some point. Maybe. of veracity. Nope. Not even worth carrying. Little diversion, nothing really going on there. The keening, I'm sure I'll be back to that.
Okay. <clears throat> well, I guess I'll keep going this way. So I can find the way around there. Okay, I can actually wear them, so I will. Shosses of the Legion. Gold coins. Okay. Okay. Just one fight after another, that's for sure. Ugh! <laughs> 
No. Okay, so... Go this way. Really? Luxuria. Yeah, I'll take it. Damn it, Jim. Uh. 
She's me. Okay. If I go that way, I doubt I'll find anything. Damn. Let me go around my ass to get to my elbow here. Maybe there? Fine. Okay, so this is another... Oh, I don't care right now. I just want to find this stinking thing. Well, I can go around this way and hope that it comes around there but I think I'll go back that way first see what's across this bridge real quick well actually it's a shorter way Okay. 
it. Alright. Yep, I just missed the turn. Mortals stole the secrets of magic. And now they come to take our land. against the force of a simple army. How will you fare, I wonder, against the power of a god? Only a fool denies the power they can feel. She's been yeah, yeah, yeah. more and more, and she has such interesting things to say about you. Soon, Tiernoch the Merciful will come to our world in person. Then we'll see whose life is a lie, and whose life is nothing but salt and cinders. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> okay, two down. Now I gotta get over there. So I'm gonna go straight across and try here first. of the blaze.
arm blade. What is this? Average, 98. I'll take it. Take all of those. Okay. So. Sanctuary Grotto. Dead end with a bunch of critters. Okay, I'll take them. hammers. Getting close though. As soon as I get this last one of these, I think I'll be done for the night. Yeah. A lot of those potions are not really worth my trouble.
might as well go discover this place because once it's discovered you can fast travel to it so okay there's the place I'm looking for lots of baddies around it what who dares to stand against Tiernock <laughs> as you might. Struggle as you will, you are deluded. There is no winning for you. Only death. Only death. Yes. But death as you define it means little to us. The great cycle returns each to offer as to offer again. And every time they do, Tiernock gets stronger. Soon, she will be born into this world. You will witness her power personally, and it will be the last thing your mortal flesh shall ever feel. Okay. Fast travel back to him. Can you feel the change in the land? Gadfro's voice has fallen silent in this land. The Dwarver are frightened and disorganized. They run back to Alabastra to make their final stand. We owe you much. Our eyes are opened and our blades unsheathed. Cluricon is one, but the House of Pride stands between us and the final goal. We are now free to press forward. And I can take you to an old friend who knows the next step. All righty. Yes, we will take you to his filthy tower on the island of Danistar. He hides within, and has not emerged in some time. I would like nothing more than to let him rot there. But he knows of a way past the Sentinel of the House of Pride. But there will be more danger on the path ahead. Take these blades to prepare for whatever troubles you will face at his tower or beyond. Far to the southwest, there is a darkened tree by the Caled coast. Meet me there, and we can walk the shadow to the gnome's tower. Aelin Shear will be waiting there. She was most insistent to join in whatever business you have with the Collector of the Dead. Meet me at the Caled coast. The Winterfey know of a shadow path to Ventrinio's island. Okay. We will meet again at the shadowed tree on the Caled coast. And I leveled up. Whoop, whoop. Okay. Um. Eh. Eh. Yeah, why not? Um...
Yeah. Okay, so echoes. As far as I'm going to go for now. And I will pick it up next week. Um, let's see. What are we doing? Let's see, tomorrow night is Star Wars reading, followed by, followed by Morrowind. Thursday. I will be doing um, the starting the final season of The Walking Dead. Um, yeah, final season of The Walking Dead. And Friday, I still haven't figured out what I'm doing um, as far as a new game because I finished Dying Light 2. So, um, I'm thinking I might break out one of the older games. Um, I have a list here of stuff I've been thinking about playing. Um, I could get into one of the Tomb Raiders, um, The Bioshock series. I could do Dishonored 2. Um, I could get into the Stalker series. Um, did I mention Dead Island? I don't remember if I did. Um, I've also got Sniper Elite 4 that I could be doing. I have one called A Plague Tale. I have no idea. It's a, I think it's going to be a point and click kind of thing. Kind of like The Walking Dead are... Um, I don't know. I'll decide. But that's all for tonight. And I will catch you all in the next one. Thank you for watching.